what is going on guys welcome happy monday i'm a monday person i love mondays and i know a lot of people are not so forgive me for my hyperness now today uh, we've been talking about how to launch your product or your listing properly now we talked about um how to properly uh prepare a listing right we talked about pictures we talked about uh, photographs of uh, the actual product with the uh, details in them we talked about uh, the listing itself which is basically your title description your key points now what I want to do today is I'm going to talk about sales velocity um, in that we're going to talk about social proof and why do we want to do a proper listing and what is the purpose of a product launch what are we trying to achieve so Let's start with that. So what we're trying to achieve with product launch is to essentially end up on page one, right? Because why we want to end up on page one? Because we want to sell more items. We want to make more money. We want to make it right. So that's the whole purpose of doing a proper product launch to end up on page one to increase our sales. And that is what's called sales velocity. So sales velocity is basically um, your sales, the number of sales you're doing per day and per month. And now it's increasing day by day. So we want to increase that. We want to like from selling to one from one unit a day, we want to sell hundreds of units a day, right? Because that's where we'll make the real money with Amazon. So but for that, you need something called social proof. What is social proof? Social proof is basically, um, think of it that people, a majority of group of people are doing something together and you are enticed or you already, and like, I mean, in your subconscious, it tells you that, okay, they must be doing that. This must be the, the thing to do because everybody is doing it, basically following the crowd. But it means that there is proof that people or liking this whatever it is product restaurant whatever it is and I give you guys that restaurant analogy all the time that if a lot of people are lined up for a restaurant and there is another one that's empty you're more likely to go to the one that has a lineup because there is social proof people are really really liking something about that place and therefore it must be good so that's your social proof your social proof will build your sales velocity how do we get social proof we get social proof through reviews and guys i've been talking to you guys about reviews how to get them and nobody is going to give you a review once you launch your product you have to first go hunt for it to create that social proof for yourself and from there people will start coming a lot of people have the misconception that you list your product you're going to start selling that is not always the case yes if it's a great product and people see it they might buy it with zero reviews, but you cannot launch a product with zero reviews, guys. That is just not how to do good business. How do you get reviews? So there are two ways to get reviews, verified reviews and unverified reviews. Your verified reviews are basically reviews that people have purchased your product and they've left you a review, right? Unverified reviews are reviews that people don't have to purchase your product, but they can leave you a review. How can you get those reviews? You need at least five to 10 reviews to uh, my personally, like you need 10 because you need to get to the double digits because subconsciously in the buyer's mind, 10 is a lot more than nine. Guys, believe it or not, it is a marketing tactic that a lot of people use. The double digits really flip something in buyer's mind. So we want to get at least five verified reviews and at least five unverified reviews and you don't want to go more than like 12 15 whatever because you want to really build it after that with sales you just don't want amazon to catch up to you that you are doing this which they won't if you if you guys follow what i'm telling you they will not catch you so but you have to create that social proof for people to see hey people are going and buying this product so let me see what the fuss is about right so after having a great listing, you're going to work on your reviews. The first two days to five days of your listing, you're going to work on your reviews, guys. Like, do not sit and watch and refresh to see how many sales you've made. Work on it. One way that we can get reviews is, first of all, like you can ask friends who are not on your social group. So make sure, guys, when you're asking friends um, for reviews or to buy your product and you give them their full refund back, right? 
make sure that they are not on Facebook or any social media connected because everything is connected guys Google YouTube um, uh, everything Amazon so if they get a whiff of okay you know this person and they purchase from you and all that like it just creates a little bit of the algorithm reads all those things in the back end which a lot of people don't know it's a very sophisticated algorithm guys so that's why we want to find people who we are not connected to too much right maybe just a little bit because you gotta still talk to them but you are, they're not part of your life they don't have the same last name and stuff like that so one way to do this is to join Amazon FBA groups and I love this because there are a lot of people who are willing to help around the world like if you're selling in North America of course you gotta go for people in North America so one of the ways to actually do it is I've loaded up my personal Facebook here you go to groups right and then you're gonna search Amazon FBA that's it right and you're gonna find all kinds of groups here guys join um, join these like the first one that comes up is basically Derek struggles group I don't know if you want to guys join this Amazon FBA newbies high rollers beginner mastery like all gurus have basically their Amazon FBA groups here uh, all gurus that you see on YouTube so all kinds of Amazon FBA groups why do we join these groups the reason is so that you can start conversating and you got to do this way before you launch your product you got to prepare them up until your launch so you start contributing when people ask questions in the group in these groups jump in and answer provide honest feedback provide value and once you start connecting with some people that way and they really appreciate it they will be more inclined to help you and then when you launch your product I say guys it's exciting day I've launched my product I nearly need your help uh, DM uh, so pri uh, private message you if they're interested in doing a review for you and you will give them the full refund back and then on top of that you'll give them an additional 10% so that for their time right and best of all I want you guys to write your own reviews do not rely on the buyer or uh, whoever is writing the review uh, whoever is like you've asked to do the review to actually write the review why because who knows your product better than you nobody you have spent your days on this product research and everything so make sure you write a very compelling review do like 10 12 different types don't send the same review guys to the to different people because that's just gonna look odd so I want you guys to write the review send it to them and say on top of that I'm gonna save you the time here is the review to post that's it not only you've given them a review you've saved them time and given them money back but you have now a review that you really really want to get right you have basically constructed your own review that you really want to get that is gonna really make buyers appeal to your product so that's why we do it ourselves and that's why you approach you join these Facebook groups to ask people ask people and people are willing to help guys like there's a lot of people that I found that are willing to help in early stages they I used to do this all the time um, and uh, once you've built some sales velocity like you don't have to do these things too much but as a beginner years ago I did this like I knew that I had to do something and so this will really really help you guys get at least 10 reviews and once you have that right then of course you're spending a little bit of money because you're refunding them for the entire product and they're getting the product for free and all that but then again guys it creates your social proof it really solidifies your positioning in the market and when Amazon sees that this seller is selling it's gonna start increasing you and pushing your product to page one uh, bit by bit and that's how we build a proper social proof and sales velocity which is very crucial in the beginning stages of your product launch because that is really gonna push your product and really really create an environment for you to be successful so that's it guys this for this portion of our how to properly launch your product the key strategies next thing we are gonna talk about giveaways and PPC campaigns so um, I don't know if I'm gonna do two videos for that or one I haven't decided because there is a lot of material to cover but that video is gonna be up on Wednesday and if we do continuation that will the next one will be on Friday same time guys 12 p.m. I always do it at 12 because I want you guys to know that this is the time that I'll be launching my videos 
So um, my videos are coming out Sundays, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 12 p.m. sharp. Thanks again, guys. I really appreciate your viewership. I hope you guys learned something valuable today. And if you have any questions, drop it in the comments below. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe to this channel. This information is free, guys. No charge, nothing. I'm here to help you guys set up your business uh, since a lot of my stuff is running like really well and I'm basically, I have the time to help you guys now. So that's what I'm doing. And I hope you guys enjoyed these videos. Share them, share them with whoever you think is doing Amazon or gets thinking to get into Amazon FBA. Share these videos because the information will clarify a lot of their questions that they have and will really help them decide if Amazon is right for them or not. So thank you guys. I really appreciate you guys. Thanks again and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Bye.